Prove Charles right about the relaunch that it's going to be bigger and better than the original. Well, it's, it's going to be bigger and better. I'm just like any other business, man. Once you start off, you're going to start off at a certain plateau. And like everybody like to always say, oh, he has some bumps and bruises. I ain't no bumps and bruises. It's just somebody did something bad within the company. But the big ball of brand is a family brand, and we're just going to keep going forward. What's going to be different is the design, the people I got around me. I, I learned a lot of different things, you know, having publicists and everything. Uh, LaMelo is expected to be certainly at the top of the NBA upcoming NBA draft, right? At if not top, number one. What you call at the top? What number do he wear? Well, number number one well, would be. he got to go. That's where he has to go? What number does Lonzo wear? That's why he went number two. Don't be crazy now. I set it all up like that. <laughs> I set it all up like that. Okay. Okay. So, Will, here's the question. Will LaMelo. Hey, you lucky uh, Jello did his little fiasco going the other way, or he would have been the number three pick. Right. <laughs> so, 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 if LaMelo is number one, will he, when it comes out, will he be wearing a big baller brand shoe? Will he be wearing a big baller brand shoe? Uh, I don't know. You guys have to stay tuned for that, man.